Hello and welcome back to another episode of Warhammer Rogue Trader. My name is Iken and today we're continuing the blind playthrough on unfair difficulty. Life is not fair and we are currently trying to get off of this really, really unfair planet. Shoo. Let's um, position all of our characters. I think Abelard uh, is going to here so that he can charge in. Pascal, I would love him to take half cover over here. Uh, Heinrich for now, uh, cover here. Argenta cover here, Saiken cover there. Cassia cover over here. Sort of could move to here. Unfortunately, there is no other cover. I mean, Cassia, on the other hand, could also just move forward and try to kill them. She's relatively early in, in the initiative order. Heinrich. Um, word of the Emperor. Support. Uh, we could charge in, or, 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 we're moving the up, is on our side. giving Abelard a little bit of a support, the and then are enduring whatever is going to come by ourselves. Pascal, finally. 35% isn't super hot. Uh, we need to scout this guy and open it for weakness. Let's see. Oh, it's a 50% chance. Still not hot, but okay. Uh, we're not going to move from here any further. Hence, let's do this. And then it's a question of whom do we want to hit. Do we have a nice little AoE? Oh wow. Oh no. Are you kidding me? Okay, well. We're effed. That's a lot of enemies. Listen. Chaos spawn. 95% shot misses. Wonderful. That's what I'm talking about. Um, yeah, how about we're just continuing to scout all of them, simply to make them easier targets. I just wonder how uh, the whole planet could go to an absolute stomp fest in a matter of less than a less than a few minutes we're on this parade right this triumphant arc and what kind of security service is it that they just basically fail to identify hundreds of cultists that are just freely roaming the streets am i the only one who finds that a bit weird all right Eyeless, uh, Lidless, Stare. Fantastic damage. Absolute exquisite damage. And whilst we're at it, we have so much Veil Degregation. I'm not sure if we're... If we're getting out of this without Veil Degregation. Heinrich just gets some healing and... Our gender needs that extra, uh, needs the extra stats. I realized, so we're helping her out. Okay, Saiken, what are you going to do? I think we're moving over here. Melee, melee, this guy is melee as well. Might as well go ahead. 
soaked tribute. Fantastic, good hit and a kill. Um, oh wow, we could even hit these guys down there. This cultist is turning into a demon. Yeah, let's just try to get as many cultists down as possible. Dominate this guy, and we're done. <clears throat> Argenta, what are we going to do with you? Um, so say, if I was to shoot through here, that wouldn't be too great. But this, on the other hand, would be pretty dope. And thanks to increasing movement on her, we're not too bad. Okay, well, I think we can work with that. Alright, moves over here. Free action, Furious Resetto. We are getting closer to that momentum. Rapid Fire. Into... Uh, are we concentrating fire? No, I think we're just rapid firing. Because I want to move on afterwards. Couple of good hits. Faith without deeds is worthless. Moves to here. And that could be a kill. Strike is a mm, good job, Argenta. Yep. I mentioned it before, and I will mention it again. She is. After the reskilling, she's much better. Uh, Abelard, I think I would like to go to here and catch the demons with him. My place is at the so, slowly but surely moving there, declaring you as the main enemy. Uh, taunting both of you. Nice little hit. I like that. Can't charge into him, so might as well Indeed. just put endurance on, and we're good. Out of my way. Heinrichs move. Uh, Heinrichs move up. Uh, moves up. Everybody gets buffed. Let's see to it. He gives himself iron arm as well, just so that we're dealing more damage. That's uh, a solid strike. Lovely. That's exactly what we want to do. Pascal. Um, It's a Chaos Spawn with a Needle. 31, that's a good hit. That is an excellent hit. Uh, continuing to scout him. And open him so that he's easily hittable. Could hit these guys or alternatively try to shoot down here. But that wouldn't work, and no one else is clustered up. Hmm, there is a chance that we would blast this guy out of the ether. I like it. Come on, Pascal. Ooh, 39 points of damage. Lovely. Everybody else gets their joint analysis, so that scouted targets 
get in bonus extra damage. And we do have a problem on this side. I serve the ruinous powers! Focus. Death to non-believers! I'm enraged! Alright, Cassia. Um... I think we're continuing to buff because there is still a lot that we could do. Uh, we could also reduce the veil degradation, but for now I think we're fine because it seems like the enemy is. Hmm. Let me just double check. This would be moderate damage. This we could do. We would potentially take an attack of opportunity, but we're relatively safe over there. Let's do that. Okay, apparently no attack of opportunity. They could indicate it a little bit better it's when you're getting one and when you're not getting one. Alright, who do we want to buff? Uh, I think Saiken would be a good idea. Uh, we could buff Abelard for the extra um, constitution. I think we're buffing Abelard because uh, he also gets movement speed as a buff. And that is important. Me? If you insist, Lord Captain. All right. Can't hit that cultist. We could very much hit these guys. I think we need to focus on the Chaos Spawn. That's the biggest problem for us at the moment. Purpose guides me. This is beneath me. Good, that's 20. Yeah, our stream just doesn't deal the same amount of damage. That's the problem. I Let's go. No 22. Should have maybe used uh, mm, the the uh, aim Others shot because every me. every single uh, hit chance above 95 percent improves crit chance so there is actually a logic behind over aiming quote unquote moves to here oh yeah that's a good shot For the week. Concentrated fire, and let's go. I'll do it. That's very, very solid damage. I like it. I like what I'm seeing. Okay, so be clear sworn enemy we're putting endure out there victory is imminent that's not the seneschal's job and that's some really solid damage with 45 we're we'll using heroic act for another hit and another hit. And another hit. Follow 
follow my lead. We move to here, and I think what I would like to do for starters, we can still use a ranged attack. Good, not a problem, and brace for impact. Very good. Good, great turn. Let's see to it. Uh, we are. Everyone, step aside. The the veil is completely full. I won't object to it. We're healing ourselves by damaging. Devils and Heinrich, Heinrichs just stays, so to speak, in the second uh, row. Can't hit any of these guys, can I? No. Oh, my daughter is in complete and utter love with the game. So, not that leader of uh, the cultists, and I think we're just overcharging on him. Mm. Too bad that didn't work out. Okay, we have an interesting like choke point uh, right here. Uh, we could kill that last Archelite. That's another interesting way to uh, to hit all of them. Let's see. Afterwards, Argenta still needs her turn. I wanted to move her to here. Unfortunately, Abelard is coming after her. Again, I wish you could just delay shortly. You know what I could do? I could simply uh, let Adabart uh, move. That's the solution to my problem. All right, moving up. Not a hundred percent sure how that uh, hits Argenta. Look, I would get that, but how is this year hitting her? Huh? Okay, that's a wonky calculation. In which case, we're just going to reduce the veil, mend reality, and let our tank move. Who charges to here? And then declares sworn enemy over here. And he just needs to tank for now, so all of you. 
Indeed. Go attack him. Fantastic. Cassia begins to move over here because why not? Give me strength. Let's hit the cultist down there. Uh, it's a solid miss. We're trying again. And the 95% shot missed as well. That's really unfortunate. One step closer. Okay, that's the perfect opportunity. Question is, will it provoke a melee attack? But we're going to find out. Faith without deeds is worth. The answer is no. It does not. I refuse. Not. Doubt is for the weak. All right. Can always count on that flamer. I will do my duty. One dodged. But other than that, we hit both of them. At your back and call. Taunt them. It will be done. And we're enduring them. Okay, cool. Alright, Heinrich's uh, got a couple of unfortunate hits. For the throne's glory. We're healing. Um, hmm. You know what? That's A2. Yeah, that is better. And that would, hmm, that would be fantastic. We still need to scout the Chaos Spawn. It is too difficult to hit it. Way too much dodge, etc, etc. And that's what you are here for. Pascal helps. Uh, scouts them. Matter of fact, scouts all of them. Matter of fact, scouts all of them. We're just reducing his damage. Good, both of the Void Beasts are very well kept. Uh, that guy on the left hand side really doesn't do much. But the random moss um, growing somewhere here, that is scary. Good, the littlest stair debuffs all of them nicely.
And someone needs to get a bonus turn. Yeah, maybe Pascal over here. Deals decent damage. I think that's fine. Scouts and opens the armor on the Chaos Spawn. And. Gives everybody joint analysis, that's fine. Pasia unfortunately cannot move anymore. Ruin beckons. Bend the flesh, shatter the spirit. Great. Not bad. Can't reach any of the others. Alright, Chaos Spawns are almost down. That is not the Emperor's will. Uh, which begs the question, what are we going to do here? That's too much friendly fire. How about this? I think that's okay. Now. Here we go. I'll do it. You can escape the Emperor's You don't fight like this. Fantastic. We're standing a bit in the open, but other than that, we're okay. This is unacceptable. Avalard kills this guy. Then charges down to the spawn, and uh, we are declaring this as the sworn enemy. And you're in short. There you go. The cultists here are dealing more damage with uh, that uh, with that area. To themselves than to anyone else. But of course, Lord Captain. There we go. Invigorate. I won't object to it. Naturally. I'll put my psychic abilities to use. For the throne's glory. Pascal has taken quite a bit of damage, and I don't even know why. I think it was because some backlash, machine spirit backlash. Healing ourselves. Um, reducing this target's armor. One normal shot, and... We're getting back into the perfect spot. Death to Finally, I was waiting for that a long time. Me. 
If you insist, Lord Captain. Battlefields are always drowned in scarlet. Isn't this a job for the search? All right, little is there. I'm not and we're healing Pasco slightly. All right, Saiken, finally. Has the option to get this guy down. One into... I reject the very idea. Two. I'm a member. Nice. 38 points of damage, that's good. 44 points of damage, that's even better. I think that's pretty much it. Uh, but that's good for a heroic one. Uh, that was nearly 100 points of damage. Alright, give her a couple of bullets. Not perfect, but okay. God Emperor, move through me. Be the fire in my heart. I refuse. I've seen worse battles than this in my time. At your beck and call. Good, let's kill this chaos I'm spawn. Not Care of it will be done. Benji. Chaos guides me. Yep. You guys are not going to survive this. Get me a target. But of course, Lord Captain. Let's see to it. I won't object to it. Request approved. Good, the leader of the cultists, I think, is the last serious threat. Case Heinrich, you take another turn. The Emperor is on our side for the throne's glory. Oh, oh, not great, but of course, Lord Captain. We just summoned a blood letter, and this uh, thing doesn't look like it's I will broken around. 95% shot solidly missed, not good. One step. Yeah, well, it is definitely not joking. Another weakling claimed. <laughs> All right. All right. <clears throat> I needed to take a short break. Uh, let's get back into it. So, Argenta unfortunately is being pushed down, which means Abelard. 
needs to take over this blood letter. So unfortunate. Victory is imminent. All right, there we go. Strike it, and hopefully it will attack us. Now press on. I'm grateful. Cassia gets some healing. We're not using any more psychic abilities. That has just caused issues. Instead, let's see to it. We're going in to endure our situation here, and but of course, the blood letter takes a little bit more damage. Good. One kill. Blood letter gets spotted out. We're reducing its damage. Alright, overall good turn. Now Cassia. Uh, Cassia would trigger if she was to move, and she would also trigger if she would be staying here. Um, Me. She's just healing herself. Isn't this a job for the serfs? Abelard. I am a navigator, not a servitor. Gets a turn. I like that. Uh, how about? It will be done. More enduring and nice. That was a wonderful crit. 63. Fantastic. Yeah, Cassia is just going to stand there. Ravage and conquer. Saiken moves up. Give me a crit. There we go. With your demise. Fantastic. Unfortunately, we can't do. We can't yet use our desperate measure. Tried and tested tactics are the best ones. Taunting. Indeed. It will be done. Grey hair, sure hand. At your back and call. Good, we're down to 30 hit points on the blood letter, and that cultist is the last one, and he's just basically standing behind behind the cover. Naturally. Down to one hit point, really. Um, Fantastic. That resolves the problem with uh, the uh, demon, finally. And we're just trying to heal people here. Through chaos, I stride. Moving up. Purpose guides me. <laughs> 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 
There we go. Okay, we got a couple of wounds out of it, but as you can see, that was overall a really, really hard fight. Lots of chaos spawn. Unfortunately, the entire chaos um, guys are not offering anything of value for us. Um, telepathy staff. Vision of death. Uh, the target must pass a willpower test or take mental damage. If the test succeeds, the level instead suffers. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not a hundred percent sure if that is any good. It's single target DPS, but the thing gives plus ten. I wonder if we compare our staff then that is also plus 10 willpower but it has lightning arc and lightning arc isn't bad at all I don't know visions of death That's like what? Psycho staff power level, that's 9. Plus Psyker's Psy rating, that's 10. Plus 30% of target's current wound. So, hmm. Hmm. Well, that's not too bad against really high hit point targets, I would say. Like Devils, for instance. Because for a 300 hit point target, that's like over 100 points of damage, right? Alright, we're giving it a go. I want to test it. Good. Let's hope we're running. Uh, let's hope sincerely that we're not running again into mad cultists. I have my fair share of them already, but potentially in the starport there are going to be some more. At which point this is going to become a three-part series because I would need to do a little bit of a break yet again and the fights are just too long with this if we manage to find an intact shuttle in this burning hellscape it will be a miracle sent by the god emperor all right I'll... for a person as important as the lord captain i am certain there will be a vessel waiting where it should be surely okay. the commoners know their place in the evacuation order I will update uh, all of the characters and give you a rundown. Alright, really not much to report. Uh, everybody got their mastery um, part 2. The more interesting part the next time would be, I think from now on we're very close to level 16, which means we can then get our next archetype and I was looking forward for that. The world trembles beneath my feet. Your existence is not that ashes. I will level you! Well, see guys. We're being ambushed again, and that means it's gonna happen in the next episode. I am very sorry, but too many fights to do it in one episode. Thanks a lot for watching. We're going to do this one as a cliffhanger, and in between episodes, make sure that you 
uh, put a med kit on the like button uh, it has taken a little bit of damage from all of the fighting thanks a lot have a good one and see you soon bye bye